Hi, and here we are again. Welcome to another instalment of the Video Marketing Strategy Vodcasts, a series for brand managers, marketers, and sales directors looking to use video to grow their business. Modern life means we have to be good at millions of things, but we can't be good at them all. So we have to turn to experts for advice. And what better place than YouTube or Google? Other search engines are available. Help content answers the questions people are searching for. Driving SEO and organic search ROI. How to videos and other help content allows brands to attract attention and hold engagement. They're also powerful as they can both reach the masses and drill down into micro niches. Episode 80 of How to Finger Knit has 6 million views. Episode 80, still hitting 6 million. If there's a niche, help content will help you get to them. Just for a moment, think about the key stages of the digital sales funnel. At the top, we're looking to attract attention. A hurricane, we call this the awareness phase. And help videos are great at this point because they're highly searchable and they deliver strong organic traffic, even with limited activation budgets. Don't miss out on the easy and affordable wins that well-structured help content can offer. Through evergreen content that delivers long-lasting search results, help content drives long-term brand growth, but there's more. It's also really good at driving short-term sales goals, which is something that many brands overlook. Building timely help content around specific events, along with the inclusion of a price point narrative, can be super effective at boosting sales at specific times in the calendar. Think of people searching for how to cook turkey videos at Christmas, and what would happen if they find a grocery brand offering not only how to do it, but a single click package of all the ingredients with a discount. Help content meets price activation. It's a winner. If you're using how-to videos and help content to draw attention at the awareness end of your sales funnel, here are some tips. One, use tools like storybase.com or Google's Keyword Planner to look up which search queries get the most interest each month. Then look at which search terms are underserviced. Then it's a simple case of making a good how-to video that answers a popular question that no one else is answering. Two, although you're focusing on answering questions, don't forget your brand. What's distinctive about what you do and what's your angle on the content? Three, viewers love tips. Are there any life hacks that will help people get more than they realize? If it ties in with your product and service, that's even better. Four, look at tools like YouTube Trends and Answer the Public to find out what other people are up to. Okay, so help content is gonna be helpful in raising awareness at the top of the sales funnel for sure, but can also deliver long-term brand growth. Below the awareness phrase in the funnel is where consumers are looking around at what you do. They're seeing what makes your brand tick and they're finding out more. We call this the consideration phase. Help content works here because it keeps people engaged with what you do. If you can get people to treat your content as a regular source of help in the future, it's gonna increase your traffic across the board. Now at this stage, it's not subject matter on its own that's important, it's how you join multiple videos together. If you can encourage people to watch more helpful how-to films, they engage with your brand positioning for longer. So to round this all off, here are some general how-to video how-to tips. Aim to inject a bit of character into your video. Robots are easily forgettable. Tell the complete story. Missing steps will annoy people. Make your instructions chunkable. Offering information in small bursts makes it easier for the user to digest. Adding chapters is also a great way of letting people skip forwards and backwards. Lastly, aim to offer something helpful and original. If the topic has been covered before, only repeat it if you can make it better. That's all for this film, folks. Thanks for watching.